Lost individuals tend to go for trails or natural features such as rivers. Unless they're close to a ridge line, people tend to go down. We can use this to our advantage. If there is no clear point last known, deploy drones over likely areas such as trails and waterways. With an approximate location, like a cell phone ping, start the drone search from there, typically approaching from below since we know people tend to descend. If you have a point last known, start by sweeping trails and obvious openings in the brush because people will travel in places that are easiest to move through. Often, the drone team finds the lost individual before the ground teams can even reach the initial search point. For the lost individual, they almost always say that the sight of the drone brings them immense relief, signaling that help is on its way. Please stay tuned for part six as we continue our search and rescue discussion.